Hey everybody, welcome back to the Nth Design channel. In today's video, we'll build this fun RGB LED desk toy that uses RFID cards to let office visitors easily change the colors. When this project started, I didn't really know what it was going to be. The only thing I knew is that I wanted to make some sort of sign with my name on it. I started by designing some custom lettering in Fusion 360. Each letter was extruded and shelled. I added some small tabs on the back that would allow me to attach the letters to a backplate of some kind. I printed the letters on my PrinterBot Simple Metal. The prints took about two hours per letter. To light the letters, I cut up a strip of WS2812 RGB LEDs. Here you can see the RGB LEDs in action. I'm using a 5 volt Arduino Pro Mini to drive the project. They're cheap and super easy to work with. From the beginning, I wanted visitors to my office to be able to interact with this desk toy. I wanted that interaction to be fun and self-explanatory. One day I had an epiphany. If I connected an RC522 RFID card reader, I could use the unique IDs of each card to trigger color changes on the desk toy. The hexadecimal numbers you saw on the cards are the unique IDs for those cards. In the Arduino code, I wait for an RFID card to be detected, and then I read the unique ID and do a lookup to determine which color to display. Once everything was working on the breadboard, I sketched some optimal wire paths on graph paper. Next, I soldered everything in place on some perf board from Adafruit. Their perf board has solder mask and plating on both sides. I use these pre-bent perf board wires. If you don't have them, buy them. Everything is mounted on the back of the foam board using hot glue. Even the feet for the desk toy are made of foam board. On the right, I made a foam board pocket for the AA battery holder. Also, you can see in this shot that the perf board has header pins soldered to it so that we can use DuPont-style female connectors for the RFID reader and for the RGB LEDs. To make everything pretty, I used some 15-year-old Avery labels I found in the basement, and they still stick. This is one of my favorite projects to date and it is a lot of fun to use. If you liked this video and want to see more like it, click the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.